Damn it. Bros. Oh, it's pretty warm outside. I haven't really had a chance to check the temperature. Mwah. Yeah, it's pretty warm, dude. Yeah, this weather has been so inconsistent, though, man. Like, one day, like yesterday, it was like 70, bright, sunny, you know, not a cloud in sight, and now it's like, well, like, just pure motivation right here. Like, I love that. I love that. It's not bad outside, though. It's actually a lot, temperature's a lot more pleasant than, uh, than I thought. But there is one good thing about today's video. And I'm about to get to that. So, so, Rick, sit. Paul, 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 Paul. Oh, dude, I think he's, I think the camera, Paul, Paul. Yep, the camera makes him nervous. Let's just go inside. Get that right there. And boom, we back in this bish, baby. The gym is cleaned out and it feels great, dude. If you guys watched my last video, let me turn this light on. Oh, damn, it's dark in here. If you watched my last video, we had a lot of shit. We had to move out of the garage because my aunt moved nearby and we we're helping her out a little bit. Bye. Moving some of her stuff closer to her actual location. Talked about it in my last video. I'm not gonna talk about it now. But basically, we had a lots of boxes, a lot. Just random stuff, just random stuff scattered around the gym. But now you can see the leg press. Now you can see all this area. And yeah, man, it's looking good. I love it, man. It's like, it's like, it's, it's like, it's like, it's good. <laughs> Clock. All right, so I just used the stopwatch app pretty much. I stopwatch for at least a minute. Oh, here we go. Yeah, to be 100% transparent and honest, like the entire time when I'm doing each set of a minute, I kind of hate my life and kind of wish I had like a Stairmaster or something where I could just get on and get it over with. But, you know, it is what it is. And today's not the most motivating day of the world. I was kind of talking about motivation in my last video. Not every single day you're gonna wake up and be hyped about doing you know, cardio or something, but you just gotta remember, you gotta do it. I'm not gonna sit around and not come in and do what I plan on doing every single Thursday. So, that's kind of the drive. The, 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 the fat on my face is also the drive. Uh, I definitely wanna stay decently lean throughout the winter while, you know, putting on a little bit of size and muscle mass. It's hard for me to breathe. I don't recommend talking while you're doing cardio, but, you know. This is it is what it is. Gotta make jump roping a little bit more entertaining than it actually is. I hope you heard anything I just said right there. Maybe the jump rope was super obnoxious and a dumb idea, but yeah, today's definitely one of those days and it's not super into it. You know, the sun's not shining in, so it feels later than it is. That's usually what that's usually what kind of throws you off. You kinda of wanna work out at a decent hour of the day. It feels later than it is, so you kinda of just wanna like, ah, using your, doing your own cardio is, is fun once in a while, but it also is nice on days like today just to get on a Stairmaster for like 15, 20 minutes and then just call it because it's easy to sit up there and you let the machine do the work and you have to keep up with the machine. Wow, when you're doing it yourself, like jump roping, burpees, circuits, you kind of have, you can control the pace and make it 
easier, you can take longer rest in between each circuit, kind of throw it off, make it longer than it has to be. So it's one of those days where I kind of wish, even a treadmill on an incline, something that like sort of does the work for you, and you kind of just have to like do it and you know, get put, literally put on a YouTube video and watch it in the entire time. But you know, I do have the Versa Climber, but again, that is on your own pace, it's not a machine. You do go on your own pace, and when it's cooler inside of the gym, the thing, yeah, I'll show you if you don't know for reference, the Versa Climber, it's all on your own pace. It's a lot more difficult, you can't watch a video, and see, yeah, it's a lot more difficult than like a Stairmaster, I mean, yeah, than a Stairmaster, that's the Versa Climber, so. <sighs> Literally just did jump rope for a minute and talk the entire time, so not a smart idea. But uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So that's that, man. You just kind of have to just do it and just get it over. Either way, we want to get it over with today. So that's what's going to happen. I'm doing 10 sets of a minute on the jump rope. Probably into some boxing. We, we, I think we'll get into it. We'll get into it. Uh, but it's, it's, it's one of those days, man. Screw it, jump rope is not for me. It puts way too much stress on my tiny pathetic calves, and I'm, I feel like I'm not even getting cardio in. That's though. I did two minutes, two minutes consistent jump rope for my fifth set, just, just, just to get it in. I was like, this is stupid. I want something that gets my heart rate up, just like that. Just like boxing. Find something that works, man. Jump rope is just all, all calves in my opinion for me. For me, you know, go, go ape shit on the box. I'm already sweating now. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. And hold up, we're about to do some high jumps right now. But to mix it up, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna teach you a thing or two about just getting some, any type of cardio, man. It doesn't gotta be fancy. There's one thing I learned about having a gym to myself. There's a lot more to work with than you think. Because you're not thinking. So you gotta think. Just to simplify what I'm even doing right now. So I'll just, at the end of the day, cardio. If you're getting your heart rate up, you're getting out of breath, that's cardio. It doesn't really matter if you're, what you're ex what exactly you're doing. It could make no sense. You could be dancing like an idiot. But if your heart rate's up, and you know, you're sweating like crazy and shit, chances are, well actually you're definitely pretty much doing cardio, man. It doesn't have to necessarily be on a treadmill. See, like, see, see what happened to me? I was like, Drowsy and lazy. And as soon as you get the heart rate up, you start sweating a lot. You kind of get into it. Like I said, you just gotta play some music. Whatever it's in your headphones, on a speaker. Just, just do something, bro. You can get, you can get through it. I promise. If I can get through it, sure as hell, you can get through it too, man. Woo! <clears throat> Got some shit in my throat. I 
am here in the middle of nowhere There is no there, it is cold there But I am safe and I am warm Although it's hard, I know I gotta keep up No time to lay to drift away I fill my space, I spend my time Down the rabbit hole again And as I fall I can feel the pain You can tell me where to go So I don't know I just go with the flow I go with the flow I'm falling up, I'm falling down From the sky and from the ground Up above just like below I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. No, I, sh I pretty much shit the bed for today's video. Video, so let me shut this TV off real quick. But that was a little bit of a physique update. Looking at like we're looking at no pump whatsoever. We just hit cardio. Uh, 21 years old, about five eight, five eight to like six two, six two on a good day. Um, probably weighing in like the one, the mid 170s, closer to 180 range. If I had to take a wild guess, because personally, I don't like to weigh myself. It's not that I don't like to weigh myself, I just really just never get around to it. There's never really like a scale laying, lot, laying around. I usually just use the mirror to uh, judge everything. And then I use my gym progress and like the strength gains and shit like that, too. Obviously, you gotta track your progress in some way, shape, or form. Otherwise, you'll never know if you're getting anywhere. But yeah, that was pretty much just the physique update. Super flat. I don't even know how it came out. I just kind of used the light right here. Nothing special, man. Nothing special. What, 21 years old? Did I mention that already? Uh, 21 years old. 21 years old. Seven, eight years of pretty consistent training. I think I started training like pretty hard around like freshman year of high school. Not hard, but I was getting more consistent. And then I got more consistent like sophomore year. And then junior year is really when it kicked off. So I'd say like four or five years of like consistently going pretty hard. Okay, and then, you know, definitely, there's definitely years of experience though, you know what I'm saying? But <clears throat> nonetheless, I'm just gonna, you know, for all the fitness guys out there that are just interested that are watching this video for just straight fitness, it's your lucky day because I'm gonna show you every single supplement I'm currently taking. I'm not really taking a lot of supplements right now, honestly, for the most part. So for the most part, I'm honestly just taking pre-workout. This is Hooligan. This is Apollo Nutrition. Y'all very aware of that. There's a link in the description. Luke 15 if you want to save your money on any Apollo Nutrition. Protein, BCAAs, post-workout, fat burners. I've had the fat burner before. It's chaos. It's pretty good. It's like a pre-workout pill as well. It gives you a lot of caffeine. This is empty though. I just have it because I have a lot of bullshit on my shelf. Definitely BCAAs. I uh, haven't actually, per honestly, I'm going to be 100% honest. I haven't took BCAAs in a little bit now. Just kind of been getting lazy because I've been drinking straight. Oh, well. Straight up water, man. Change up the gallon, but still on that water grind. I finished this probably by the end of the night and piss about you know, 60, 70 times a day. So that's that's an update on that. But supplements to take every day. Arginine, citrulline, and I just get the complex because why get the two separate when you can just get the same same thing? Best of both worlds in one pill. Citrulline and arginine, take this before my workout, three, four pills for a good pump, good blood flow. You know, good blood flow in any area of the body, if you, you know what I mean. Uh, other pre-workout I've been taking this this I've been taking a lot just because I wanted to lay off my my baby I've been consistently taking hooligan for a long minute uh, probably half a year at this point so sometimes I like to throw in a little mix throw in something a little bit different just to get the so when I come back on the hooligan you know get all the the, the best the, the best perks of it man uh, I was taking Shogun Shogun is basically like a pre-workout pill aka fat burner pretty much just like chaos by anarchy labs anarchy labs is associated with Apollo Nutrition. So that works, correct? That pretty much works, man. This shit's pretty hardcore, especially the first week I was on this shit. It's, it's really good for pre-workout, man. That shit gets you amped. Five grams a day, dude. Straight up creatine monohydrate. Don't get anything fancy. You don't need anything fancy. Just because the tub looks cooler and it says strength, endurance, size on it, you know, like clarifies it for all y'all. It doesn't mean it's any better than five grams from a plain tub. So don't spend your money on and waste your money on like, you know, a fancier, Creatine, because creatine is creatine, just like protein's protein. Picking up what I'm putting down? I hope so. Otherwise, 
Y'all screwed. Y'all screwed for your money, man. Taking uh, a live vitamins, man, for men. I would hope for men, right? And uh, these are just gummies. I take two a day, and that's that. Melatonin. It is a supplement, so I might as well just throw this in here. Sometimes it's the pre-workout. It's just going too hard. Sometimes you need some melatonin. This is just a CVS brand. It's not really necessarily focusing, but I'll take one at night. Uh, gives you a lot of crazy ass dreams. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you up straight up. Straight up, it gives you some. It gives you some dreams, man. Yeah, but man, it's like I, like I said, you know, uh, don't hate. I mean, this is pretty much a straight, straightforward video, man. Straight up seek update. A little bit of energy and uh, hype for all y'all in the gym. Just a just a cardio day. Kind of shit the bed today. Um, I'll blame the weather this time. I'll blame the weather this time. And you know, I post a lot of videos, so you got y'all gonna have to let me know what you guys want to see. So when I like pick up the camera every morning, uh, y'all, I'll know exactly what to do for y'all. But this, this is this is okay. Straight to straightforward video, man. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm not gonna drag this out. Drop a thumbs up, man. Uh, check out my last video. Some of my last videos are really good. I did a TikTok reaction with Jake when he was here. So if you missed the TikTok reaction because it didn't get the most optimal views, it's a full vlog too. So go check that out. Subscribe if y'all new. I love y'all. Peace. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Always stay hype, stay hungry, and always lift happy.